Hey guys, I'm bored. I was very bored because I don't have classes today nor do I have classes tomorrow. So I figured I'm just going to do kind of like a haul video but not really. I'm just going to show you some interesting slash maybe weird stuff that I got recently. I'll show you some stuff that will help with makeup, with skincare. If you want to know more, then just keep watching. I'm going to first start off with stuff that I did not necessarily got or didn't necessarily purchase. These are gifts. So the first one that I'm going to be talking about is this makeup brush cleaner. Um, I got this as a gift from New Chic. As you can see right here, it does come with this kind of stand with different brush attachments and the whole like spinning machine thingy. This is what the bowl looks like and then it comes with its own like stand and then the brush attachments and then the actual machine looks like this Tada! it also comes with this like white thing so you push that in the machine the actual spinning thing this one and then you put different brush attachments to fit the brush that you want to clean. So most people like usually put in like soapy water and then spin their brush here. But personally, I like to clean them off of brush cleaners like this one. I find that it cleans the brush quicker. It's more thorough with cleansing as opposed to like spinning it in soapy water. But anyway, um, to show you guys an example, imagine that I put in some soapy water here and then I'm going to need to clean a brush like this one. The end is kind of like really thin, so obviously with this kind of attachment, it's not going to fit properly. So I'm going to take the brush attachment with the smallest hole, push that in there, make sure it's very secure. And then it has um, three settings. Like I said, just imagine there's soapy water here. So it spins like that. That's the first setting. This is the second highest setting, and then this is the quickest um, highest setting, So you can see right there. So you just put in some water here and then just rub, I guess, the brush against it. So that's how the cleaning generally goes. For me, what I do is use this instead for like drying it off. Since you guys are on my channel, I'm assuming that most of you guys are aware of the struggles when it comes to cleaning makeup brushes. Half of the fight is like waiting for it to dry up like properly. I really needed this because um, it's very cold in my city. The sun barely comes out. I'm lucky that it's quite bright today. But generally, it doesn't shine that much. There's not much heat. So drying clothes, drying brushes are a nightmare for me. So ever since I got this, cleaning brushes were like one, two, snap, done. So yeah, this was very nice, very easy to use. And it's actually sturdy. It has a charging port right here. So when the spinning is kind of slow, that's when that's your sign to charge it up. This is definitely an interesting, weird purchase, but I'm sure that I'll be able to use this for like years or so because like I said, um, although it's very cheap, it's definitely, definitely high quality. I'm grateful that this was gifted to me. Anyway, let's move on to the next thing. So these are the brushes that I got. It's definitely very fun, very cute. I already used the blush brush from the pink set. Uh, anyway, the pink set has more of like face brushes, you know. It has this multi, multi-function brush that's very good for like sculpting the face for cream blush, cream contours. It has different um, powder brushes, very big fluffy brushes. And then it also comes with some blending brushes for the eyes. Meanwhile, this champagne set has like two big brushes and the rest are like detail brushes blending brushes and some packing brushes so this is not very weird or interesting i just decided i wanted to share this to you guys because yeah um new chic does carry manj so if you don't have Shopee in your city or region, definitely check out New Chic because they also have very affordable makeup brush sets in their shop. 
Oh, and by the way, this wig, um, if you can't already tell, <laughs> this wig is from New Chic as well. It originally looked like this. It's in a very curly um, pattern, but I wanted to straighten it out just to take away the shine a little bit, kind of make it look more natural or human hair like so um yeah i don't know if it's working but personally i like it more when it looks like this i don't think it's too clockable definitely with the beanie it looks better but um without it the hair light is like weird but yeah i really like this because compared to the other wig that i got from shopee it has just as much shine and just as much hair fall but this one definitely feels like thicker and um more full anyway enough with that <laughs> um so yeah those are the stuff that i was gifted by new chic interesting stuff that i think some of you guys may also want to purchase but aside from that i also got another thing on shopee and this is what it is it's a facial spa kit so it is a 4-in-1 facial brush, waterproof design, deep cleaning, cosmetics removing, pore shrinking, skin tightening, facial massaging. It has a lot of claims, but it just generally looks like this. So it looks like this. It's very similar to the brush cleaning machine where it spins. So yeah. Um, this is the machine. This is it at its lowest setting. This is the medium setting. And then this is the highest setting. This is as fast as it can go. So if you press it one more time, it stops. It has a waterproof design because it has this like um, silicon plug. So yeah, this is where you plug in the connector when it comes time to charge it. And then when you're actually using it, you just plug this in so that the water doesn't um, come in the machine. Yeah, this, this has been like a very helpful purchase. I've been using it for maybe two weeks now. Um, I'm sorry, I didn't tell you guys because I, <laughs> I was testing it out and I was not really planning on making this video anyway. Um, but yeah, it looks like this and it comes with three other attachments. So it comes in with this silicon cleansing brush. This is supposed to be the brush that you use when you want to take off your makeup. I think it's very ineffective, um, so I don't really use this much. Um, anyway, I double cleanse. And then this is the second brush head. The bristles are made with like a softer, more bendable material. So I think this is the brush head that you're supposed to use for like everyday cleansing. But you know, like the rebel that I am, I still use this um, brush head. Compared to this one, this brush head is definitely more stiff. Like it really scrubs the skin. So I don't think it's good for every day um, just because it might irritate your skin especially if you have a sensitive skin type i don't really use it every day i mean i use it every day but for the morning i use my hands and for the evening just to really get everything off of my skin this is what i use um, when my skin is feeling sensitive this is what i use and also it comes with another attachment that looks like this this is supposed to be like a facial massage attachment definitely very good if you like do facial oils and stuff if you want to deep puff your skin i think that this is going to be a good attachment for that but yeah anyway that is this purchase another purchase that i made um it's not weird more than anything it's actually just unnecessary <laughs> because i got another um organizer so the organizer that i currently have is this one so yeah it's an acrylic um slanted kind of organizer so this is where i store my eyeliners and my brow pencils my pencils and pens i also bought this one which is a wider version of that um, I still don't know where and how I'm gonna use it maybe I'll use it for like lipsticks or something because currently um, all of my stuff are like organized in their own proper place so I'm not entirely sure what I'm going to use this for but I'll find something 
<laughs> I'll find a reason to use this and I'll make sure to update you guys. I'll probably do a vanity tour next time um, for a future video. Um, not really a vanity tour, just show you guys how I organize probably my makeup because I do have like different stations for that. Like I use the top of these clothing drawers and then I use this rack that I also got from Shopee. And then I also have um, my skincare and makeup brushes organized in front of me. <laughs> I'm not going to show you guys yet. I'll probably save that for another video. But yeah, what else did I buy? Hmm. Since we're on the topic of weird purchases, I'm going to show you guys that I bought like a whole bottle of melatonin sleeping pills, I guess. I feel like two to three weeks before classes started, I was really having trouble fixing my um, body clock. Like, there was a time where I was up for almost like two days straight and oh, I don't know how other people do it. I don't know how I did it before because like it really messes up with your brain. I felt so disoriented um, and I got sick of the fact that I would just like roll and like move around in bed trying to um, get some good sleep and so yeah like I got sick of that. And then I decided I wanted to get some sleeping pills. I can't say so far whether it's working. It doesn't really get me drowsy or make me want to sleep early. But every time that I use this and when I lie down, once I let go of my phone, I just knock out in an instant. I don't feel sleepy though. So that's like the weird slash surprising part. And um, yeah, I do feel... A little bit more energized in the morning i don't necessarily feel groggy which is like the tendency for some other people it's kind of like a side effect with these melatonin pills um i'm probably oversharing at this point but <laughs> that's another weird purchase so yeah this is the last weird purchase that i'm going to show you guys if you're on tiktok a lot you probably already know what this is i know it looks sus um it's an overnight heatless hair curler got that so yeah this is an overnight heatless curler i got this from shopee for i think maybe 150 or 250 i don't really remember the price of it but it does come with its own like hair clip so um, to show you guys, I did a video on this on TikTok, so if you want, just check it out, I guess. But for those of you who don't have a TikTok account, this is normally how you use it. So you just um, place it on the center of your head and then use the clip that comes with it to like clip it in place. And then you wrap your hair around it. And then when you wake up the next morning, your hair is supposed to be like very curly, very um, bouncy, voluminous, I guess. Um, it didn't really work out for me the first time that I used it, so I'm probably going to try it later. I'm going to probably try it this evening just to check out like what it's really about. But for the first time, it was like, eh, yeah, it's so far, it's not really worth the money and the effort of me going to buy it. So yeah. I, I think those are the only weird purchases that I've made online. I did buy some nail stuff, but I'll probably save that for a video next time if I do make a video about nails again. But yeah, that's a very quick rundown of the stuff that I got recently. I don't know. I think quarantine like really messes with your head. If you use online shopping as like a form of coping mechanism, you will end up buying a lot of useless stuff like I did. But yeah, uh, if you liked this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you like me, make sure to follow me on all of my social medias. And if you want to keep seeing content like this, then consider subscribing to my YouTube channel. Um, comment down below if you do want me to make more like chit chat haul videos like this one. And I'll try to make another one soon. And yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!